much of the work we've done sending analytical level samples to prospective customers, to cathode manufacturers, to cell and vehicle manufacturers. And being on the other side of the table for many years, we always understand that these are not commodity metals, these are specialty chemicals. Every customer has a slightly different specification. They want a little different type of material based on the specific processes they use. So the first thing we did was work with our prospective customers to co-develop specs for every single impurity, for every single type of morphology, actually agreeing on the specifications they wanted. And they're used to buying products from, from ore, from virgin metal, where no matter what type of resource you have, to some degree, essentially, the entire periodic table is in a material sample when you pull it up. So there are so many different types of impurities they had to worry about. We see it was much more of a, a wide breadth, really trying to reduce large amounts of impurities. Whereas when you start off with a recycled material, the type of unique species in a battery is much smaller than a virgin material. So we're able to be much more targeted and speaking with them, we're able to surpass the, the level of impurity removal by an order of magnitude compared to what you generally make from a lot of the virgin materials. So it's been a lot of back and forth about seeing the impact that that has on the type of active cathode they make and the performance it results with in the cell itself. Mm -hmm.